The word persistence doesn't even begin to describe the entrepreneur you are about to meet. For nearly two decades, he's been trying to get the eco-friendly windshield wiper he invented noticed in the broader market, and he's not giving up. By day, Leonardo Nelson is branch manager for Urban Partnership Bank. In his off hours, he's working hard to promote an invention he calls Tri-Track EcoBlade. The idea for the windshield wiper came to him at 4.17 in the morning, 19 years ago, in the form of a dream and a voice, he says, was divine intervention. I woke up and that was the idea that I had, is go tell your dad this idea and see what he says. And idea and he was like you got a good idea. He created the concept and took the idea to executives at Ford, Chrysler and GM in 1993 where he ran into obstacles. It has to have some evidence that has been accepted into the marketplace. You forgot to get new wiper blades. Well this time get Tri-Track. So far he has spent $250,000 trying to do that, including creating this infomercial showing how Tri-Track can come in handy when a wiper blade goes bad because it has two spares. So you get out of the car, you pull it out of its holder, you rotate it one third time, you put it back in, you have a brand new windshield wiper. The infomercial was expensive and ran on major networks. And even though the market at the time was soft because it was just after 9-11, he managed to sell 20,000 tri-tracks. But he has spent his savings and lost his marriage. It's been such a challenge um, trying to get this off. And I know I, I used a lot of my money that was for my family, but I, I did that because I wanted to try to give them a better life. Still hoping to hit it big, Nelson is getting moral support from co-workers at Urban Partnership Bank, just not financial support yet. One of the biggest things that I think entrepreneurs miss is the advice that you can get from your financial institution. And because the product is biodegradable, Nelson has been shopping the Tri-Track EcoBlade at inventor competitions. Considering motorists are supposed to change their wipers every year, Nelson still believes in his idea and the possibility of big money. If I can't continue to pursue my dreams, what are my children going to think about me? They're going to say, Dad, you gave up. Nelson will try next to get his product promoted on the TV show Shark Tank. We will keep you posted.